In this video, I'm going to show you guys how you can install ChatGPT into your Google Docs. So that way you can use ChatGPT features inside of your Google document. So what we want to do is go up to the top left and we want to go to where it says extensions, then click on where it says add-ons and click on where it says get add-ons. This is going to bring us to the Google Workspace Marketplace. And what we want to do is go to the search bar and search for GPT for docs. And we want to go to the one that looks like this one. It says GPT for Sheets and Docs. And we can see that it works for both Google Documents and Google Sheets. Go ahead and click on where it says Install. Then click on where it says Continue. You're going to need to allow a few permissions for this application to actually work. But then once you do allow those permissions, you're going to see that GPT for Sheets and Docs has been installed. And we can go ahead and click on where it says Next and we can click on where it says done. So now we can go ahead and close out of this. And the next step is to go back up to the extensions. And now we can see GPT for Sheets and Docs right here. And what we want to do is go to where it says set up API key. And here's where we're going to need to enter in our API key for OpenAI. So if you go to the link in the description, I'll send you to this page right here where it's going to send you to the platform for OpenAI. You may need to create an account if you don't already have one. And what you wanna do is go to the top right where we see our profile here. And now we wanna click on where it says view API keys. And here I'm gonna generate a new secret key. It'll say API key generated. And what we wanna do is copy this API key by clicking on this green button right here. That's gonna copy the API key. And now what we wanna do is go back to our Google Docs and we want to enter in that API key right here. Go ahead and tap on where it says check. And then it'll say that your OpenAI API key is valid. And so we can go ahead and click on where it says save API key. Now OpenAI comes with a free trial by default. So you have a certain amount of credits you can use until you'll have to start paying for OpenAI. But but with the free trial, you can go ahead and actually start using ChatGPT commands inside of your Google Doc right away. So what we want to do is now go to the top and click on extensions. Then for GPT for Sheets and Docs, we want to click on launch sidebar. And what this is going to do is it's going to open up a sidebar on the right hand side here where we can see we can write a prompt and we can submit it and get it inserted into our document. So I'm going to go ahead and check insert prompt in the document. And then I'm going to enter in a prompt. So for this prompt, I'm just going to enter in something like, let's say, write a birthday letter to my best friend, John. And then we can go ahead and click on where it says submit. And now we can see that once we clicked on submit, it automatically generated this from OpenAI and inserted that response right from GPT into our Google Doc. I'm going to go ahead and delete this and we can go back to the sidebar here and we can do other options other than just a custom prompt. We can do changing tone. We can fix grammar or spelling mistakes. We can summarize and we can also translate. So there's a lot of different options that we can do for GPT for Google Docs. And you can also change the settings at the bottom here. So here we can see that we can choose a different model. So right now we're using GPT 3.5 Turbo. We can also use these other models like the Text DaVinci 03, Text Babbage, et cetera. And if you're familiar with how OpenAI works, you can also change the temperature, the response tokens, and the amount of paragraphs that you want to max out. So let's say you don't want more than 10 paragraphs, you can set it to 10, or maybe you don't want more than two paragraphs, so we can set that to two. So all that is completely customizable and it's directly inside of your Google document. But anyway, that is how you can install ChatGPT inside of Google Docs. If you want to learn how to install ChatGPT for Google Sheets, I'll have a link to the video on the screen that you can check out right now.